Hello, we're gonna watch another video. Hot off the press, just showed up. Okay, so look, uh, I'm just gonna review this video, and normally I probably wouldn't bother with this, but I want you guys to pay particular attention to the people, not and just focus this time, like I said, on the race of the people. Okay, they're not black; they're actually white. So just, and I want you to compare the, the two for a uh, compare a situation where they would have, if they were black, how it would have gone. I I personally would believe that if the, if if the, if the if the people that had uh, in this video, the subjects in this video, if that if they were black, we had a different outcome, and I mean by the politics of it, there would have been a whole bunch of unnecessary to, uh, politics just feeling the flame, and one hundred percent would have Mr. Richie here out here just pouring gasoline and making all sorts of nonsense narrative. So focus on this because now we know, like I said, there's no blacks here, but yet this was, it, it, you know, he, they, they were still taken into custody. But had it been with black people, it would have been different. That's why I'm doing this, just to compare the two. It, it would have gone into some nonsense, political nonsense that we don't need to be going. So there you go. So enjoy. Bye. And once again, please like this video. Okay, like, share, and comment. Thank you very much. This is uh, this video is kind of funny anyway, and uh, depending on how you look at it. But basically, <laughs> I wouldn't even have done this video, but I, I did it to prove a point. I did it to prove to our friend, uh, uh, whatever, uh, Richie, there, a point. Because usually, like something like this, okay, if we just if we just replace the two the two uh, people there and you know put black people there instead, he would have been crying racism. I, I I'm literally will guarantee he'll be doing that right now. But now we get to see this that this is happening to two elderly ladies, and he approached, and he he's gonna carry from there. But right off the bat, that's why I want to do this. I want to compare the two and how this had it been two black people right easily be turned uh would have easily turned into some kind of a racist thing and it would have been something else completely guaranteed absolutely guaranteed because we incentivize it and we encourage it okay and that's the thing like everything has to be about race and that's what this is that's why i'm doing this okay has to you know from him there something criminal there don't need these don't, don't you don't touch it through hands off. Police brutality. Snatch. Hands off. Police brutality. Let go of the ID. Police brutality. You're going to go. <laughs> okay, so first of all, it's important to know what's going on here. Okay, apparently these two sisters were pretty much acting the way they're doing here as as the way they were doing at the movie theater. Apparently, he got into like a racist spat with somebody else and somebody thought it was racist. So anyway, regardless of that, the manager wanted to escort them, wanted them out back. They obviously wouldn't leave, right? So that prompted them to call the, uh, the you know, uh, the law enforcement. And then when they show up, this is what they're getting. But you know, the the big thing here is that th there is obviously a, a resistance here. There is no respect at all. There's no respect at all for uh, law enforcement. That's just the first thing you see here: complete disrespect. And, and you know, even if you work there as a regular staff, okay, uh, and this is just, you, know, this is disrespectful. It's just the way they the way they are, the way they're just so just showing just the resistance to do anything. They don't want basically they're just here basically to start something. I don't know what's going on here. Anyway, so obviously what's happened here is that she, he asked for her ID. He had the ID, but as he's still talking to them, he just reached she reached out and grabbed the ID. I, yeah, you know, I, and according to him, he scratched the finger. And that's what most people think is funny. It's, 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 I don't know why people think it's funny. Whatever. Uh, because he's saying that. Maybe they're making fun of the, the fact that the guy is supposed to be a guy. Uh, he's a policeman, big, tough guy, and he's complaining about his finger. Whatever, regardless. The thing here is this, though. is the way she reached it. Okay? You, you shouldn't have that kind of a reaction to a police officer. You, you just... The sudden, the sudden reach, it's almost like a strike. Anybody, people can react. People who are especially trained in certain uh, ways to deal with that, if, it's, if a strike is coming, they could react in a counter, you know, like a counter strike way. That could be actually dangerous, a person doing that. And well, there was no warning or nothing. She just did that and grabbed it and probably scratched his hand doing it. That should be discouraged for anybody. I mean, it, you shouldn't be able to just blatantly reach out and struggle with an officer. I mean, he's still the one there he's called because someone called him. I mean, just comply. It's that simple, right? Uh, I think these days people are really just too entitled right now. Let go of me. You're going to go to jail for resisting. How about that? Resisting what? You just turned a non-criminal act into a criminal no, act. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Really? 
I'll, fi I'll be filing a complaint against you. What is your You're name? You're going to jail for resisting. Do you understand that? Stand up. Resisting what? Stand up no, now. Girl, let me show, see your hand. Stand up. Of course, now that there, there was no actual, um, like the, the person, that, uh, the owner or the business called the uh, the police because they they felt somebody didn't want to leave. That's what they're here because you see that that's the thing. You always want I mean, when it comes to certain things like this. <laughs> I don't know why that's so hard. It's always better just to do it at the lowest level. It shouldn't escalate any more than that because then this is what you get. The police shouldn't be here in the first place. When they ask you to leave or when the staff ask you to leave, there's the door. Just go quietly. Don't make the situation worse. If you've got an issue, then file a complaint later. This right now is hard to guard. It's, it just makes the situation worse. Okay, If you felt mistreated, just walk out and fight the end of the day. You know, properly. But instead, they choose to stay. And this is what causes, and this is what causes them to get somebody else hired. And now they have to call a higher authority. And this person shows up, and now you're supposed to leave. But they're still not leaving. Let's not forget that. I mean, if the owner tells them to leave, and it's their place, and the person won't leave, and then they do the right thing, as opposed to getting the security guards and kicking them out, and they get the law enforcement to come, you know, get, uh, you know, that, that takes that liability from the owner. Okay, so these people are here. Yeah, law enforcement is here, and they're still not leaving. It's clear they're not leaving. <laughs> I don't know what what is next after that. The next one, obviously, now you have to be placed. At, if you're resistant, if you won't go after they call the higher authority, who else do you want to call? S someone, a squad team, or something else? No, you gotta leave now. So this is what's going on, and now they're gonna make something that's so simple big. You're going to jail for resisting arrest. Do you understand? Resisting arrest for what? Stand I up. said resisting. You snatched Take something from me. Everything is being audio and video recorded. Do you understand? Let go of me. Turn around. Put your hands behind your back. Let go of Diana. Brutality. Brutality. Get Police on your brutality. Belly. Get Once again, she's not complying. And now she could possibly hurt herself. And somehow she's going to try to blame it on somebody else. If you're not going to listen to the police, who, you gonna, who are you going to listen to? You, you, we don't... What's going on? Like, just do as the police says. And everything's going to be fine. I mean, yeah, sure, you get But how you left the first time, you want to come to this. And now she's still resisting and making it worse. And you could possibly injure yourself. Get on your belly now. You are way get out of line. Have a seat. Like I said, everything is audio and video recorded. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, so when you snatch your ID away from me, do you understand you committed a crime? No. Okay, you're going to jail for resisting. Okay? <clears throat> do you want to play the same game? Please have a seat. I'm gonna get my stuff off the floor, please. The manager wants them both trespassed. Okay. She is going to jail for resisting. Okay. Resisting wasn't anything. I took my driver's license back. He said he was she giving us a citation. She from my hand and hurt resisting my finger. Resisting He told us that we you were hurt trespassing my and to get out. And that's, that's what... Do you understand so that? Yes. And he's got it filmed. I have it filmed so we don't have to argue about it. Okay? He said that we trespassed to get out. <laughs> and he was writing us a citation that is not Excuse resisting she, she arrest. You're, you're trespassing. They were trespassing and they should have gotten out. I mean, they asked him to leave. It, it, didn't, it didn't have to. Once again, the big thing here, it didn't have to get to this level. It didn't have to. <laughs> but it did. And now this is what we get. Trespassing. We paid. We paid to get in here. We paid. Absolutely. No, you were not trespassing. That's correct. Mm -hmm. I told you they were issuing a trespass Don't, warning. I, she wasn't talking to you. She was talking. Well, to she's me. wrong. She's wrong. Excuse me. I'm she trying to correct opinion. her. No, you don't. You don't correct anybody. Just she's not. Nobody's talking to you. Zip it. So now I have to zip it. In this. At this rate, I probably wouldn't even talk to him at this point. It just becomes back and forth, and there's no real point to this.
free country you speak of, I have to zip it. If I do, you do. I've never told you to be quiet. Scratch you, you see what you did to me? Okay, you don't touch me. You don't touch a police officer, do you understand? But you can touch a senior citizen. Absolutely, when she commits a crime, she's gonna get she touched. Touch a crime. She's so he, yeah, like I said, he's got a point, okay? Whatever she's suffering, she brought it onto herself because she was resistant. Nothing would have happened to her had she not resisted. But there's no point talking to people like that at that point anyway. She's, she's going to get touched. She didn't commit a crime. She I did to me. I took my driver's license back. Well, say what you want. You took it and you scratched my finger. Let's see your injury. Right here, you scratched me. There's no scratch. Like I said, at this point, I wouldn't bother talking to them anymore. This is... Yeah. Oh, you scratch me. It hurts. Take a picture of his finger that he's claiming that because it's on his It's going to be on body camera. Well, then hold your finger up and let's oh, see this scratch. I'll take the picture myself. Thank you. Well, I don't, see, I don't need miss, you do it. Well, it, well, miss... Well, there isn't a scratch before uh, you make a scratch. Citizen rights complaint. Taking pictures of me. Anyway, we're going to stop it here. So there you have it. Uh, something that small, like a, as an anthill, something small as an anthill just turned to a mountain of a problem now because you just won't listen. Uh, maybe they're bored. Maybe this is a good way to get some action. Maybe this is, this is like a bucket list. Um, they want to put on a bucket list. I've heard about this before. People want, people, people uh, just, that's one of the bucket lists is to get arrested and put in jail so they can go talk about it, how they've lived uh, supposedly fulfilling, uh, a fulfillment uh well fulfilled life i guess yeah so the big thing to take from here is once again they were these were uh the, the race was different and i just want you to pay attention to had it had just been a different race you would have seen a different outcome just pay attention to that particular part okay and yeah they go out so do i agree with what happened yeah i do they were resistant and and then now they have to be made an example of it's that simple you we, we cannot let one go if they let him go Mr. Richard here will be like, oh, man, goodness, uh, if that had been a black person, you'd have arrested him. Well, now, there you go. This, this hopefully this shuts you up. All right. Well, then, like again, once again, uh, please like this video. Uh, share this video. I want to hear your thoughts. Comment, please. Leave your comment. And then, yeah, hope to see you uh, next time. Thank you very much.